Hello everyone, it's Big Seller. This video is about how to process your orders in Big Seller. Now just hit orders and select processing orders. In this page, we can see there are six different lists here. The all order list will display orders with all stages. And in this list, we cannot change anything but to view the orders. The next list is new order list. Actually, Big Seller will auto sync your orders every 30 minutes. But if you want to see the real time order, you can click the sync button here to sync it to Big Seller. Now let's process the orders. Just select orders and click pack. If successfully, it will move to the in process order. If failed, it will be moved to the pack failed list and will be listed with a reason. We need to modify the orders according to the reason list. Here, and click this button. If the selected order requires pickup, it will jump up a page like this. We need to fill in the info, then click Save and Pack. Now my order moves to the in process order list. In this list, we can also see three sub-stages here. Orders under printable can be printed with shipping label, pick list, summary list, and invoice. For orders under to get checking number list, we need to click this icon of this button to refresh it. After refreshing, it will move to refreshing list, and if it successfully get the checking number, it will be moved to the printable list. Now we can print the shipping labels. Big Seller allows to print 100 shipping labels at a time from the same marketplace and same shipping methods. Select marketplace and shipping methods. Bitseller does not allow to print shipping labels cross shipping methods. Let's say one of the orders is GNT and another one is LEX. Then the shipping label cannot be printed together. After selecting the shipping method, we should select the print stator to not print it and select orders. Click print shipping label. After printing, just click mark as printed. When we need to print the shipping label next time, we can choose not printed. So we want overprinted the shipping labels. After we pack the item and paste the shipping label, we can select orders and click ship or scan it ship to move it to the to pick up order list. And when the carrier scans the order, the order will be automatically moved to the ship order list. And for the wild order, it displays the orders that you don't need to process now. You can reverse it by click this button. And here is a tip for Lazada ready to ship settings. In Big Seller, we have two Lazada ready to ship settings. The first one is packing to move orders to ready to ship. It means when you click pack button in the new order list, the order stated in Seller Center will be changed to ready to ship. And the second choice is to shipping to move orders to ready to ship. It means when you click the ship button, the order stated in Seller Center will be change to ready to ship, you will have more time to pack your orders. Okay, that's all about today's video. If you have any questions, you can contact us via WhatsApp or Facebook. Thanks for watching. Bye-bye.